morning everyone I'm just going to do a quick um, demo run through of downloading and installing star tools a lot of people seem to get stuck with the um, license bit let's go to the website star tools website that is grab your um, download the latest version which is now 1.5 something like that obviously download the one that's for your system on 1.5 hit the download key and away it go this computer is rather slow so so if I go to that folder open it up Go to the download folder. I'm just going to cut it because I don't want it in my downloads. Um, you should have a, a directory somewhere, either from your previous installation or whatever. Create a new folder if you haven't, uh, which is that one of it. I'm just going to call it Star Tools for now. I've put it on the D drive, but you can see yourself where you want it. So I've created a folder called C Drive, Control V, copy and paste that download file onto there. Now just to extract it, I'll just tick the, the stay with the default and just say, yeah, there you go. So then what you get, if I go back to the basic. So I've got the star tools. In that star tools directory, you'll have my zip file and the star tools one. The one you want is the distro file. Boom, boom, boom. Now all you need to do is copy and paste the license file into here, and then when you start up star tools. It will come up with your license. Fresh, I haven't got the license on on this one. It's on my other PC, but I think it might come. I think it's a virus, but this is the. You might. Thank you for the, this is the val. It's coming up as though I'm in the evaluation version, but if you did, if you did what I said. And just copy the license fold file into the distro folder in go back to the root. So you'll have a folder called Star Tools 1.5365 or whatever. I chose the uh, the right one for my PC system, my Windows 10 64 bit, and just copy and paste the license file into there. And then when you start up, whichever one you want, 32, 64, what you can do is right click on it on the file and pin it to the taskbar. And now there's a task star tools logo for that 64 bit one on there. Wow, I'm so oh, I'm so clever. <laughs> Thank you and God bless and good morning. Stop.